Okay, what is up everyone? Tyler here and I'm back with another video. Gina's over there. I pulled her out of the garage and I think she has a small oil leak. I need to get oil right now. We fill it back up. I'll show you guys what it looks like. Not sure where it's coming from yet. In the meantime, I checked my oil and it is very low. That means I'm gonna go to O'Reilly's, get some stuff, refill it. And we could talk about me selling the car. Nah, I'm just kidding. I would never sell the car. Although I do want to talk about if I didn't have that car or if I sold it, what car would I get? Whether it's reliable or not, I just want to speak my opinion on this because I think it'll be pretty cool, but we need to go to O'Reilly's now. I just get the cash and did the dash all on the way. I might keep that 40 and it's hold up on my head. I might steal that shorty and she hold up on my shit. I might just Since in the live stream, you guys mentioned you liked me sitting in my car and talking to you guys. Let me roll up that window. But my car has a lot of drones, so I hope you guys don't mind that. Ever since the alignment, this car drives perfectly the only thing about it is it's decently low and that's why I don't really like to bring it out but I really do want to try to daily this thing some of you guys are also wondering why I show just stock cars restoring their headlights. It's just what I'm doing on the side and I wanted to document it. Civic is my daily, that's why I don't drive this thing a whole lot. That's besides the point. What I want to get to today is what if I ever sold this car? Like if anything happened, what car would I get next? I've had this car for two to three years. It's been a while. My love have never my love has never left this car. There's just something about it. I don't know. I would get definitely an older car. One that you feel connected to the road. My second dream was a Datsun 510. But it would be a Datsun 510 and then I'd go on a, maybe a 240 or E36, one of those platforms. Maybe an IS, but I feel like that's kind of still too new. There's something about a 510 that has always stuck with me. It might be the boxiness of it. I'll start by taking out everything I don't want on the car, especially like cosmetic wise I know I don't know too much about these cars, but their bumpers are like chrome. I've seen some owners rock nothing on it, and I thought that was pretty dope. I'd keep his stock body, stance it. I would definitely need whole new suspension like on that car. I don't know when I want to do this, but it, it's eventually going to get to that point. Since my G's in 05, it's pretty modern and there's, there's not really a need to change anything. Like, everything's perfect about this car, in my opinion. Oh my god, a Supra. And a girl's driving it. I don't know if you guys saw that. I could already imagine the 510. I think... I would make it blue or some sort of color, blue, green, one of those, have it slammed to the floor, G33 wheels, oh, it'd be, it'd be dope. 
I would also definitely learn more about cars in general. Because with this car, it's mostly maintenance that I have to keep up with and rarely at all things go wrong with me. I haven't had a major problem except for sensors going out, all that. So it gets slightly boring, especially how this car is not quick. It's funny too, because throughout social media, everyone's seeing that I'm going just stock and dialing my car how it is right now. I'm pretty sure people assume that I'm gonna sell my car, but hell no. This would be the perfect time to do it. I would try to part out everything but the suspension. I don't know. Because I don't have the suspension anymore because it scared away. This car is solid though. This was a different video as always. I'm testing out ideas that you guys also bring up. So comment down below what you guys wanna see. If you guys really wanna see something, let me know, DM me. I'm always here. Oh yeah, and I have a clip of another Civic that I did, headlight restoration. Morning everyone. It's morning for me actually, but I don't know, whenever you're watching this, great. Today I'm gonna be restoring headlights again. That's what I'm trying to do. Last video you saw me clear coat headlights. I'm gonna do that method again. I got a parking garage. That is why my car is parked all the way over there. And yeah, it's just really difficult because I'm low and yeah. Okay, so I'm doing the Civic. It's pretty bad to be honest. Josh, the owner, well, not previous owner. <laughs> <I'm> previous <laughs> guessing, by the way, but he said most likely it hasn't been washed in so long. So I'm gonna do the clear coat. I just get it cash and did a dash all on the way. I might keep that 40 and it's hold up on my head. I might steal that shorty if she all up on my shit. I might just be trapping at a steward on my jets. I just keep that clock up in my pocket and it hit. I like getting money, get the profits, then I did. I might take off in a. This is all done, all clear coated. I think there might be some like wear inside because of the. Yeah, for the most part, cool. show you guys before and after. Um, yeah, now the car is just crying. Currently, I've been restoring headlights a lot. I have one big project to detail a car for Week Fest, not Weck Fest. Stay tuned for that. Anyways, guys, thank you guys so much for sticking around. Thank you guys for watching, and stay tuned for the next video.